Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, welcome back to another Star Wars Galaxy of Adventures action figure review. Oh, this one has uh, come to me again from Goodies Toys, appreciate it. This is uh, really cool. I still would love to get a hold of the Ahsoka, but uh, yeah, she has not been around anywhere online here in Australia and uh, does cost a fortune to get one from the United States these days. So hopefully one day I'll track one down, but uh, Pretty, pretty excited to have have the uh, 332nd clone here, which is, looks looks awesome. So let's uh, let's bust him open with his little plastic prison, and we'll take a look at the trooper. All right, and here it is. And uh, you know, just one thing I want to say that I love about this figure and the Ahsoka is that. It's still taken a few years, but I think over the last couple of years, Disney's really realized how important the Clone Wars is to Star Wars in the future. Um, and it's past, really, it's in 2008. And and above that, above that, if you uh, count the Tartakovsky series. But, uh, you know, Clone Wars has come a long way. It's it now has nostalgic value for those kids that grew up watching the cartoons, you know, after school. And you know, now they're adults and uh, loving it. And for a lot of us who are, you know, I'm in my mid-30s now, and uh, Clone Wars very much kept Star Wars alive for me for those for those few years, sort of in between um, Revenge of the Sith and, uh, you know, Lucas selling to Disney. I think that's uh, definitely what was going on there. It's just it kept it alive for me. But, uh, yeah, loving the look of this trooper. He looks great. Nicely sculpted, nice sort of animated sort of style the head head sculpt there looks nice I do prefer the clones with their sort of black band over the brow line but that's okay it looks fine for this one but yeah nicely posable comes with his blaster it does have like a little flick sort of gimmick that they all have um, but yeah, it's not hindering of the figure at all because it's still awesome. You can sort of click them back and you can adjust them. Let's just say that. That's probably the best way to put it. You get a couple of clicks back and then you've got it where you want it. So yeah, a nice, awesome figure. I'd love to get another one of these and a soaker to go with it. That'd be so good. Yeah, big fan of the 332nd. I just, I don't know, there's something about it I love. I really do. Every little bit of my willpower not to buy the Hot Toys one. So yeah, nicely poseable. Great, nice, vibrant colours. Nice sort of clean armour, nothing dirty about it. it. Looks good. All the paint apps are nice and clean. Nice blue stripes, blue, blue. And the orange on the helmet, which, you know, it's just iconic now. Absolutely iconic, fantastic. Do love this figure a lot. So again, thanks to Andy at Goodies Toys. I appreciate it, mate. You're, you're an absolute champion. And, uh, yeah, looking forward to getting this one on display. With some other Galaxy of Adventures figures. They actually really like the figures, to be honest. They're, they're quite cool. So I thank everyone for watching. Please give this video a little thumbs up if you enjoyed it. It's the thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't yet subscribed. I'm very close to doing a 4500 giveaway. So close. So I'm really looking forward to announcing that and uh, making that happen. Looking forward to it. Really am. So thank you for watching. Until my next video, may the force be with you. Always.